थैंक्स टू ऑल मीडिया फ्रेंड्स नाउ एज सेड बाय कॉम्रेड रंगा राव दैट देयर विल बी ए ऑल इंडिया यूनिटी कॉन्फ्रेंस ऑफ थ्री कम्युनिस्ट रेवल्यूशनरी ऑर्गनाइजेशंस सी पी आई एम एल प्रजापंथ पी सी 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 पी आई एम एल प्रोविशनल सेंट्रल कम्युनिटी सी पी आई एम एल एंड सी पी आई एम एल रेवल्यूशनरी इनिशिएटिव दीज थ्री ऑर्गनाइजेशंस विल मार्च इन टू ए सिंगल ऑर्गनाइजेशन एंड नेम ऑफ द मार्च ऑर्गनाइजेशन विल बी सी पी आई एम एल मास लाइन एंड देर विल बी ए थ्री डे कॉन्फ्रेंस फर्स्ट डे दैट इज ऑन थर्ड मार्च देर विल बी ए रैली एंड ए पब्लिक मीटिंग एंड देन फोर्थ एंड फिफ्थ दैट विल बी डेलीगेट कॉन्फ्रेंस एंड फोर्थ आफ्टर फ्लैग होस्टिंग देर विल बी इनोगरल सेशन एंड एंड दी इनोगरल सेशन वी हैव इन्वाइटेड फ्रेटर्नल पार्टीज from various countries and also from our countries also and we are expecting that uh, a comrades from german comrades from nepal and other countries also will participate and similarly we have invited our uh, fraternal organization inside our country and we are hope that uh, there are also many organization will participate so uh, this is the unity conference to unite all the communist revolutionary forces all the communist revolutionary forces as you know that after 1967 25th may that was the naxalbari incident was there and after that incident many comrades revolted against the revisionist leadership of cpim and formed cpiml and also here uh, under the leadership of नागी रेड्डी डी वी राव सी पी रेड्डी कोला वेंकैया दे ऑल्सो फॉर्म देयर आंध्र प्रदेश रेवल्यूशनरी कम्युनिस्ट कोऑर्डिनेशन कमिटी सो नाउ एज ऑफ सिचुएशन नाउ टूडे द कम्युनिस्ट रेवल्यूशनरीज आर बैडली डिवाइडेड इन टू वेरियस ऑर्गनाइजेशन सो द प्रोसेस इज कंटिन्यूइंग दिस यूनिटी कॉन्फ्रेंस इज रिजल्ट ऑफ ए फिफ्टीन मंथ्स we have started that process in 2023 january discussions is going on after 15 months we came to a common understanding on the party program on the party constitution on the political resolution and on that basis there will be a unity conference and all the three organization will be march into a single organizations so we are appealing to all other communist revolution organization to be united to build a single all india party so our ultimate goal is to build a all india communist party uniting all the communist revolutionary forces so this is the first step this is the first step for building a all india party so we are inviting and through you also we are inviting all the communist revolutionary forces to unite into a single party single party all india single party is a demand of the day demand of the day as you the press person you know that uh, in our country in our country if you go to the press freedom index if you go to press freedom index then you will see the position of india is very very bad many journalists many journalists are now in jail certain organization like news click totally closed so there was a great repression on the media person on the journalist and it is not an isolated in incident to so all india through the rss and bjp they are trying to impose a fascist rule throughout india so they want to change the character of our country from a secular country they want a uh, hindutva rashtra based on hindutva so th that is a great danger before us uh, now a situation is developing in our country 
that uh, they are destroying the federal character of our country. So they not only destroying secularism, they are also destroying the federal character of the country. And situation is developing such, developing such that some persons are now raising this slogan of a separate South India. This is the situation developing and the responsibility lies with the RSS BJP Modi government. So in such a situation, when a country is facing a serious attack on democracy, on civil liberties, on democratic rights, and country is going to the aid of the fascist rule. So in that situation, it is utmost necessary to fight against fascist forces, defeat them, isolate them, defeat them. And for that reason, a united All India Genuine Communist Party is urgently necessary. And that is not enough. That is not enough. We are calling all the anti-fascist forces, all the anti-fascist forces, those who are opposing in their own way, not in our way, in their own way, they are opposing. So our task is to unite all the anti-fascist forces into a single All India anti-fascist front. So this is our goal. So by building that front, we want to isolate RSS BJP and we want to dislodge RSS BJP from power. But our country is now facing a such a situation that regime change, government change is not only the solution. Solution is also policy changes. Simultaneously, policy changes. So in our country, due to new liberal economy, due to privatization, commercialization, liberalization, you are seeing what is happening in Delhi, uh, Haryana border. Peasants are fighting for the minimum support price. And heavy repression is going on by the central government and the uh, Haryana government. Now, I, yesterday I seen the a conference a, of the RSS peasant organizations. They are calling that all the problem lies with Amen Saminathan. These scientists are responsible for the agrarian crisis. So this is their solution. So in our country, so our demand is that not only government changes, we want a policy changes also. Our opinion is this, that if we want to defeat fascism, then are they necessary also defeat new liberal policies. So new liberal policies and fascism are interconnected. So for that reason, our fight also that we want a alternate policies. Alternate policies. We want to propagate, we want to prioritize a alternate policies so that our country can solve, face the, the problem and solve the problem. So in this situation, uh, we are going to hold our uh, unity conference, uh, 3rd, 4th, 5th. Uh, and you know that our uh, the ground, the pavilion ground, it, uh, it is named after uh, our two comrades. One is uh, Comrade uh, Robi, you know Comrade Robi, he is our leader. Uh, he, he, the United AP, he was the secretary of CPIM and the democracy. Uh, and another uh, Comrade also, Santosh Rana. Santosh Rana was the secretary of PCC CPIML. General secretary of PCC CPIML, he is also leader of the Goibollopur Peasant Uprising. You know the our conference hall. Conference hall is also named after Comrade DVK. He is also our secretary of the Praja Pantha. Eh? And another was Comrade Bhaskar Nandi. He was also general secretary of the PCC. And the conference uh, stage we have named after Comrade Sormista, or leader of our West Bengal, and uh, Sivram, leader of our Odisha. So we are expecting that more than 16 states will participate in the conference. And more or less 300 delegates will participate in the conference. So after uh, all these things, a new organization with a new name, CPIM and Mass Line, will work and tirelessly trying to build a United Communist Party, number one, tirelessly trying to build a All India 
anti-fascist front with an alternate vision. So this is uh, to say uh, intellectually this is our positions.